Hey everyone, how's it going? In today, as you saw by the title, I'm going to be giving you the top five matches that I believe we need to see at WrestleMania 34, this upcoming WrestleMania. It's never too early to think about WrestleMania and WrestleMania season and the Royal Rumble and all that good stuff. And also, as you saw by the title, I'm going to be using my WWE figures, so it's going to be great. So let's hop right into this. So the first match that we need to see at WrestleMania 34 will be the challenger, Dean Ambrose, going up against his former Shield member, the Universal Champion, Seth Rollins. <laughs> I believe that they are still two of the biggest stars that the company has right now. And I believe that either one deserved to be Universal Champion as of right now as well. And another reason why I decided to put this on the list is just because I feel like we have to see some combination of at least two of the Shield members go one-on-one -on -one at WrestleMania at some point. I think these two would put on a hell of a match. They would deliver. They know each other well. They have so much chemistry together. Back in 2014 and 2015 when they were feuding, they had great matches. And I would expect that they would have another one at WrestleMania 34 as well. So that is why Dean Ambrose versus Seth Rollins for the Universal Championship should happen at WrestleMania 34. Now moving on to the next match, we have a street fight between none other than The Game, Triple H versus Kurt Angle. Now, I don't have Kurt Angle's figure, but I think that this match would be absolutely sick. I have a feeling that they're going to do it at this year's SummerSlam, but if they waited for WrestleMania, I think that it would be even much bigger and, you know, built up better. You know, it would explode at WrestleMania. I think SummerSlam will still be good, but I feel like if it happened at WrestleMania, I think it would be 10 times better. They're having this whole Kurt Angle affair storyline. I don't know who it's going to be with. I'm thinking it's going to be with Stephanie. Kurt Angle's first match back against Triple H, you really can't find a better competitor. And I just think that this storyline, this feud, and this match would just be one for the ages. And moving on to the next match, I think any wrestling fan would love to see this happen at WrestleMania, the grandest stage of them all, and that would be the United States Champion, Kevin Owens, taking on his former best friend, Sami Zayn. Oh, but no, not just a normal match, a 30-minute Iron Man match. These two men know each other better than anyone. What a great way to elevate the United States Championship. I would hope that Sami Zayn would actually win it because he needs to get some gold. But no, seriously, 30 minutes with these two men in the ring. But you know, as long as we get these two guys in the ring at the same time, I really can't complain. They are two fantastic competitors, been all over the world. And then to culminate at WrestleMania 34, 30 freaking minutes, I think it would be a nice and classic. I think it could be one of the best matches of all time. They will bring the best out of each other like they do every single time. And that's why I feel that this match needs to happen at WrestleMania 34. And now the next match. This match doesn't need titles. They just need to do what they do best. Go into that ring and put on one hell of a match. And it would be John Cena taking on the big dog, Roman Reigns. Now, Reigns has been built up like he's going to be the next Cena, and I honestly agree with that. And then, of course, Cena being the guy that he is, he puts on fantastic matches day in and day out. Just trying to help out the future, trying to help out the younger talent. I'm not the hugest Roman Reigns fan, but I think seeing this match at WrestleMania 34, it doesn't get bigger than that. Two of the biggest stars that the company has right now. Of course, Vince McMahon would love this, but not only him. I think I would love this. I think a lot of people would love to see this. I think it would just be a huge match. And Roman Reigns, even though I hate his character and hate how they brought him up so fast, I do agree that he is one of the best workers that the WWE has right now. He puts on awesome matches. I mean, look at the freaking ambulance match between him and Braun Strowman. So I would love to see John Cena, Roman Reigns, WrestleMania 34 in New Orleans, Louisiana. It would be awesome. And then the main event of WrestleMania 34 for the WWE Championship would see none other than the WWE Champion himself, AJ Freaking Styles, taking on the artist, the king of strong style, Shinsuke Nakamura. Now this match has also been rumored for SummerSlam this year, which don't get me wrong, I would love to see it happen. How big that their names are, has to be at WrestleMania 34 in the main event to close the show. Could you imagine that scene? They would literally bring the roof down. They would bring that roof down. There's no other place where this deserves but WrestleMania 34 in the main event. And of course for the WWE title. I love Jinder as champion, don't get me wrong, but I think AJ Styles just brings another level to the championship, whatever championship he's holding at the time. But I do think that he should win the WWE title sooner rather than later. And then Nakamura, they could do something where he wins the Rumble or something. Just do something very interesting like that. And you know damn well that these two wouldn't disappoint. This is a dream match that would come true. Literally a dream match that would come true. Who would have thought like two years ago that these two would be in the company right now? I know I one of these two are the best wrestlers in the world right now they are phenomenal at what they do no pun intended actually yes pun intended but no anyways 
This match needs to happen at WrestleMania 34. No ifs, ands, or buts. Make it happen because they rightfully deserve it. So there you have it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to leave a like. Comment down below. Tell me what your dream matches for WrestleMania 34 would be or what matches you think need to happen at WrestleMania 34. And always subscribe if you're new to the channel. Remember to follow me on all social media. The links are in the description box below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, everyone. Peace.